was the debut for Stefan Schrock for Ceres and he did not disappoint with this early chance of a free kick that Tommy Trigo did well to save and there would be plenty of more pressure for Ceres in this match. Schrock again close to getting his first goal for Ceres here. But Trigo once again getting digits to the ball. Bienvenido Marañón also forcing Trigo to make a stop. On the other side, it was the new signing of Loyola, Jason De Jong. He gave some work to Ceres keeper, Louis Michael Casas. Manny Hawks attempt just slicing across the face of goal. The absence of uh, Phil Young husband, it was the brother, James Young husband. He tried to force an opener for Loyola, but his header was wide. As Trigo, plenty of more work on the other side of the ball. And then at last, a breakthrough for Ceres. The handball is forced, and the referee unhesitatingly pointing to the spot. Adrian Gagliardo to take it. The kick is good, but it is adjudged to be with some encroachment on the part of Ceres. Because of that, Gallardo has to take it again. His shot is saved brilliantly by Trigo, but the follow-up falls to Carly de Morga, his first match in over a year, making it 1-0. And Ceres were definitely in the mood for more goals. This header is just over the bar. Same story here with Manny Ott unable to keep the ball down. Drop very active in this match and almost picked up his first Ceres goal. On the other side, it was the Spanish striker for Loyola, Alvaro Castiela, who nearly caught Ceres napping on the defensive end. In the second half, Marañón forcing a save from Tommy Trigo. And on the other end, it was Anton del Rosario coming up in defense wide for Loyola. And Casas punched, the ball falls to Jingoy Valmero, the substitute, and an innocuous looking shot from up outside the box somehow filters under Luis Casas, and Loyola are level at one all. That began a sustained period of pressure from Ceres as they look to restore their advantage. There's Gallardo just skying over the ball. Tommy Trigo really put on a man of the match performance for Loyola. Substitute Jeffrey Christians for Ceres, coming very close to the going ahead goal here. His header was just wide. Another substitute, Orman Okunaya, unable to find the target. Schrock had another chance on the free kick. It too could not find the frame of the goal, but his corner met Carly de Morga once again deep in stoppage time. And his header finds the back of the net for Ceres for 2 1. They almost made it 3 1 a few moments later, but Stefan Schrock couldn't find the back of the net. It didn't matter. Ceres wins 2 1.